Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's another day, another amazing dish for me to try. And today I'm going to be trying to make and definitely eating the chapli kebab. Now this is a Mughlai style kebab, popular in the northwest of Pakistan and also in Afghanistan. And it's made from minced beef that you can see over here, mixed with lots of different herbs and spices, and then cooked in this piping hot oil. It's incredibly hot up here, but it smells so good. So this is the beef mixture here, and there's a lot of things I'd expect to see in the mixture, like tomatoes, there's chili, there's onion. But what I wasn't expecting to see is egg. There's actually a lot of the boiled egg, which is mashed up over there, and you can see it in amongst uh, the beef mixture. So that's definitely going to give a slightly different taste to any other kebab I've ever tried. He pushes it on like this, right? Just like that. And then you push it in. <laughs> I don't know if I want to push it in. No, no. <laughs> Do this guy must have hands of absolute steel. This oil is incredibly hot. You can see it bubbling. He's flattening it down with his hands and then pushing it right into the oil. I was being a bit of a wimp there. I didn't want to push my hand right in so far. So the gentlemen here are making the tandoor roti, which is served with the kebab. It's smelling delicious. I can see it cooking away in there. And they make this process look so easy. So I've got my new dish ready to try. I'm quite excited actually. Wow. Now this on the top is bone marrow, which I feel like I've tried before, but I can't remember what the flavor's like, so that's gonna be new for me again. Mmm. Wow, it's got so many different textures. The outside's incredibly crispy from all the oil and it's lovely and soft on the inside, especially when you get a bit of the tomato. Mm. Okay, so I'm gonna try some with the bread, the bone marrow, the raita. Is this too big for my mouth? Probably. It obviously goes incredibly well with the roti. It's a little bit like a burger that we'd be used to back home, except much fresher, with so many more different flavors, especially when dipped in the raita. Now, you actually can't taste the egg as much as I'd expect, but there's a lot of spices coming through. Absolutely delicious. So although, of course, it is a little bit oily, I just love how fresh it is. I was watching the guy make it right in front of me, obviously had a try myself. And this is actually one of the most popular restaurants in the area because they have a dairy farm very close by, just behind the restaurant. So everything, all the meat, right on your doorstep. Mm. 